and i must tell you smart men and ladies you know i just I usually say once albert einstein was on a flight and right next to albert einstein was sitting an indian so it was a long haul flight and albert einstein was extremely bored so i turned towards the indian and said shall we play a game he said what's the game all about so albert einstein said look i'll ask you a question and if you cannot answer the question i shall pay you you should pay me 50 rupees if you cannot answer the question and then you ask me a question and i as a renowned scientist from great britain if i cannot answer the question i'll pay you 5000 rupees in pounds he said i'm converting 5000 rupees so i said okay the indian man said your turn first sir <laughs> so albert einstein said what is the distance between the sun and planet earth very coolly the indian man pulled out 50 rupees said i don't know take <laughs> what the <difference? laughs> what difference would it make anyways you know <laughs> so albert einstein said now your turn sir so the indian man asked albert einstein what is that animal which walks up a mountain with three legs and comes down with four <laughs> so the scientist <laughs> was totally taken aback by shock He said, "What do you mean? You know, he pulled his laptop out, sir. He called for the stewardess, give me internet access. He asked for a payphone on the flight. Call of all of his scientists, and no answer. Frustrated, <laughs> he pulled out five thousand rupees, slammed it in the hands of the Indian man, and said, 'I don't know.' <laughs> the Indian man coolly put the money in his pocket, went back to sleep. You know." <laughs> So Albert Einstein was so annoyed. He woke him up. Said, "Idiot! I gave you five thousand rupees. Now tell me, what is it that goes up a mountain with three legs and comes down with four?" The Indian man pulled out fifty rupees. Said, "I don't know." <laughs> <laughs> I must tell you.